Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I have some shocking news for you. Kanye West's business manager announced that the rapper has been unreachable for weeks and his lawyers are struggling to contact him. But what does this mean for his career, his family and his fans? Let's find out in this video. First of all, let's recap what happened. Kanye West is one of the most influential and controversial artists of our time. He has won 22 Grammy Awards, sold over 140 million records worldwide, and has launched his own fashion and footwear brand, Yeezy. He also married Kim Kardashian, one of the most famous celebrities in the world, and they have four children together. However, Kanye also has been known for his erratic and unpredictable behavior. He has been outspoken about his political views, his religious beliefs, and his personal struggles with mental health. He also has been involved in several feuds and scandals with other artists, media outlets, and even his own family. The latest drama started in July 2020 when Kanye announced that he was running for president of the United States as an independent candidate. He held a bizarre campaign rally in South Carolina, where he broke down in tears and revealed that he and Kim had considered aborting their first child, North. He also tweeted a series of accusations against him and her family, claiming that they were trying to lock him up and that he wanted a divorce. Kim responded by posting a statement on Instagram asking for compassion and empathy for Kanye, who she said was suffering from bipolar disorder. She said that she loved him and was trying to help him, but that he had to accept the help himself. She also said that she respected his right to express himself, but that some of his statements were hurtful and irresponsible. After that, Kenny apologized to Kim on Twitter, saying that he was sorry for going public with something that was a private matter. He also thanked her for supporting him and standing by him. He then flew to Wyoming, where he owns a ranch, to spend more time with his family and work on his music. Since then, Kenny has been mostly silent on social media and in the public eye. He released his 10th studio album, Donda, in August of 2020, which was dedicated to his late mother. The album reached, the album received mixed reviews from critics and fans who praised some of the songs but criticized the lack of cohesion and direction. And he also held several listening parties for the album in different cities where he performed various stunts such as setting himself on fire, bringing out Marilyn Manson and the baby as guests, and recreating his wedding with Kim. However, despite these appearances, Kanye's business manager recently revealed that the rapper has been unreachable for weeks. He said that Kanye has changed his phone number an email address multiple times and that he has not responded to any of his messages or calls. He also said that Kenya's lawyers were having a hard time contacting him as well, especially regarding his ongoing divorce from Kim. This raises a lot of questions about Kenya and his well-being and whereabouts. Is he okay? Is he working on new music? Is he still running for president? Is he reconciling with Kim or moving on with someone else? Where is he staying and who is he with? And most importantly, why is he avoiding his business manager and his lawyers? These are some of the questions that have been circulating online. Some people think that Kenya is hiding from his creditors and debtors. They claim that Kenya owes millions of dollars to various people and companies such as his former collaborators, his record label, his suppliers, and even the IRS. 
They say that Kenya is afraid of facing the consequences of its financial mismanagement and legal troubles. Some people think that Kenya is preparing for a big comeback or a surprise announcement. They speculate that Kenya is working on a new album or a new project that will shock the world and redeem its reputation. They say that Kenya is a genius who knows how to create hype and anticipation for his work. Some people think that Kenya is undergoing a spiritual transformation or a mental breakdown. They say that Kenya is either finding peace and enlightenment through his faith or losing touch with reality due to his disorder. They say that Kenya is either seeking guidance from God or from other sources of inspiration or influence. Some people think that Kenya is living a normal life away from the spotlight. They assume that Kenya is enjoying some quality time with his children and friends or pursuing other interests and hobbies. They say that Kenya is tired of the fame and the drama and just wants some privacy and freedom. What do you think? Do you have any theories regarding Kenya West? Let's in the comment section. Thank you for watching.